Hi guys, today I will show you how to create uh, beautiful text effects that will improve your edits, will make them more attractive and beautiful and also will make them so that the viewer will not want to swipe your edit. And also before I start, uh, I want to say sorry uh, for my voice and how I look. I just woke up. For six months, I couldn't sleep. And after a nap it is really hard to think and hard to live and hard to say something so i hope that you understand me and also go to comments and write what other tutorial you want to see next so i'm not distracting you anymore let's go to after effects first effect it is just a simple scale effect you could see it in many edits first of all you need to create your text now just imagine that I have an edit here, click here, new and create text, write something, for me it will be example, and uh, go to align and align it to the center, go to effects and find increase tracking and add to your text layer, press U and change the position for the keys because it is too fast uh, drag it and also select it press f9 go to your graph uh, choose edit value graph and repeat my graph and now it looks very nice next effect it is fade upwards it is also easy to make again go to effects and, fa uh, and find fade upwards and also I will write something here to show you how it works uh, add to your text layer press U again and just put the keys as you like next effect it is fade out slow again go to effects and find fade out out slow and also press U and make sure that your text is fully visible and then add to your text layer. Again press U, U and it looks very nice. Uh, also if you want you can play with these keys and put it as you like. And also I forgot to say that you can make this animation in just instead uh, of fade upwards add slow fade down and it will work next effect it is position animation uh, i created more text to show you how it works just say i want to animate this text press uh, select it press p on your keyboard and click on clock near position and also if you want you can add some rotation uh, click rotation and uh, also uh, click on clock near rotation press u uh, and drag uh, the keys for position and rotation to the end of your text layer and at the beginning just change the position and rotation and look what you have it is too slow and I need to fix it just select the keys press F9 and uh, go to graph editor uh, select edit speed graph and just repeat my graph or you can put uh, whatever you want I think it looks nice repeat these steps for another text also press P click on clock rotation click on clock press U and drag these keys to the end of your text layer and change the position and rotation it looks too slow select the keys press f9 go to graph editor and repeat it or put as you like now it looks very nice now you need to add a glow for a text layer. Go to effects and find deep glow and add to a text layer. Uh, put a tick here and for smooth blending also put a tick. 
and now you can uh, play with the settings or you can repeat mine uh, for example i will put here 200 uh, for exposure i put 1.2 uh, for uh, threshold move i put 100 and that's it and also don't forget to add drop shadow go to effects and find drop shadow add to your text layer for opacity put 100 for distance you can put 15 and for softness you can put 3 and it looks very nice next effect it is thin glow select your first text and uh, holding control uh, select drop shadow and deep glow press ctrl c uh, select your uh, next text and press ctrl v then just open deep glow and open tint and enable it okay not red something like this you can also uh, change the values for it mm. just say I want here one for exposure and for spread put 20 and that's it it looks nice next effect it is bloody text to make it just click here and create uh, red solid cut it using combination control shift D then go to effects and find fractal uh, noise and add to your red solid click invert and for contrast put 1000 also for blending mode put add and uh, open of no sorry uh, holding alt click on clock uh, near evolution and right right here time uh, star 500 then put your red solid under your text uh, click here and select here luma mate example example 2 and that's it and also you can add uh, deep glow just select your solid and your text pre-compose it with my settings put a tick here then you can just copy your previous deep glow settings and control B. And that's it. Next effect it is as texture flux. I'll go to effects and find this effect, add to a text layer and add it on top. Uh, now you can see it. And then just repeat my settings. For frequency you can put seven. Here you can put two. For seat you can put 0.999. Color you can put as you like. Uh, for me, it can be also red. For bubble move, you can put 200. And that's it. It looks beautiful. Also, I need to mention that I have a free editing pack. You can find it in my previous video. Uh, there you will find uh, my text effects, uh, zooms and fixtures, uh, so link will be in the description. The last text effect it is CC light sweep. Go to effects and find this effect, add to your text and just animate the position. Uh, you can also uh, make it bigger or brighter uh, as you like. Click on clock near center where you want the animation I want it here and animate it okay it is too fast I press F9 select the keys go to graph and it looks very good. I hope that this tutorial was useful for you and if this is so don't forget to put like on this video and subscribe to my channel and also don't forget to go down to the comments and write what tutorial you want to see next, write your ideas and thanks for your attention guys. See you soon.